Welcome back to the channel, my name is Mad Dog Games, and this is the preview to my step by step series. I'll be showing you 3 main combos I was able to discover when learning these 3 characters. This is a mid screen combo for each of the new DLC characters. If you'd like to see how this video is normally structured, I have more videos like this in the description down below, as well as other types of videos that you might be interested in. We will start off with Fusion, then Robocop, and lastly Shiva. So, to perform these combos, these are the variations that you'll need. Anyways, with that being said, let us start off with round 1. The first thing you want to do for part 1 is low drift, which is forward 3. Next, for part 2, now you want to add advancing tornado amplified into retreating tornado, which is down back 2 forward amplified and then back. Part 3, now you want to add Gut Shot, which is down 1. Part 4, now you want to add Borai Toe, which is 4. Part 5, now you want to add Wind Kicks, which is down back 4. Now let's learn Robocop. The first thing you want to do for part 1 is Directive Classified, which is forward 4-2. Next for part 2, now you want to dash into Strong Arm, which is forward forward and then back 2. Part 3, now you want to add Serve the Public Trust, which is forward 3-2. Part 4, now you want to add Terminal Strip Amplified and then Delay by holding 2, which is forward down back hold 2 and Amplified. Now it's time to learn Shiva. The first thing you want to do for part 1 is by doing Outworld's Warrior, which is back 1, 2, 2. Next for part 2, now you want to add Dragon Charge, Amplify, which is back 4, 3, Amplify. Part 3, now you want to dash into Bloodlust, which is forward forward and then 2, 1. Part 4, now you want to add Untamed Fury, which is back forward 4. To be continued, if you're interested in learning more about Fujin, Robocop, and Shiva, Please subscribe and hit the bell icon because in round 2 and round 3 of the video, we're going to be talking about a wide variety of topics such as common mistakes, other alternative combos, combo strategies, wake up combos, corner combos, crushing blow combos, and other tips and tricks. If you need an example on how this will turn out, check out my recent videos on the past characters. Anyways, be sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon because in the next video for the series, we'll be talking about the most annoying characters in Mortal Kombat 11. I'll try my best to work on multiple videos, but I do want to let you know that we're getting close to my finals week, so my workload is about to increase in the upcoming weeks. Wish me luck. I just want to be done with school so I can pump out a lot of videos, because I'm just getting started. Anyways, remember to like this video if you found this helpful, and I'll see you guys next time.